Update number two. I had to get rid of the YouTube ring because it caused too many errors. YouTube apparently is in control of their player and they don't update it enough to uh, avoid errors that break animations and listeners and stuff like that. But I did make a local player which I've now attached to a bottle for fun and that means as long as the videos are on my computer they all they'll play just fine I need to still make a progress bar so you can slide back and forth but the fast forward buttons and stuff they work and it all plays oh and I'm also going to uh, the sound button works the I'm gonna make this like an info about button and this is a QR code button which I will show you another example of that in a second but I've also added article versions so if you wanted an article people I'm also gonna add a scroll bar but people can uh, scroll through it same about info I haven't gotten to that yet but I'll get to it so that's a I like the, the bottle it makes it feel more you know cool but it also works with just a card so you can hand out business cards and stuff like that but that is just one update the major update is the the vendor card idea that I had for MagFest which I made another video to show them so I'll be sending them that one but you get like little business cards that you can give out and then uh, they can come throw them on the table and look at stuff so you can either like look at their stuff and swiping through you can contact them QR code you can use that in the other video I showed you can use whatever QR code reader you want and it's pulling from the uh, the URL that they would give me uh, about text and the idea of the floor map where it would show you wherever on the floor the vendor was but I got all that working and I've been spending all my time doing that and calibrating I've done a crap load of calibrations which still aren't always enough I think I need more infrared light because I noticed my cheap infrared lights are dying so it doesn't it's not perfect and it's kind of driving me nuts it makes me question how much more time I should be putting into this project but uh, actually now that I'm playing with it I see more problems uh, anyways so lots of calibrations and in another video I'll show you how the box was put together and broken down and um, how I plan on actually transporting it to MAGFest if they want it there and I bring it. So, yeah.